Alright guys, you're probably looking at me right now like, what the fuck is going on? So, um, we got a lot of donations on the stream today, and my job is to walk around with this Hitler mustache everywhere I go, see people's reactions. I'm going out to dinner with Alex, so this is going to be a... a a vlog of my daily interactions in a park, you know, for Pokemon Go and stuff, which will probably be a little awkward. So hopefully you guys get some laughs out of this. Maybe we can talk to some people about what they think about the mustache. And uh, we're going to try to go shop for a shirt to make Alex feel really, really fucking weird all day long. So we're going to try to find the weirdest, gayest shirt possible. So I love you guys. Don't forget to give, leave a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do so and enjoy the video. Leave a comment down below. All right, guys, enjoy the show. All right, guys, so we're here at the park that I usually always uh, come to, and uh, we're going to see how this goes. Maybe we can get some people to talk to some people about the about the mustache, so we'll see what's going on. Does it not look glorious in, like, in the... Jesus. Damn. Maybe she definitely takes the stash. I don't know. But if you guys don't ever watch my Pokemon videos, they're, uh, oops, sorry about the camera. Here's the park that I walk. It's like a mile track that goes all the way around. I should sit over here by all the people just so they'd be like, what the fuck is this guy doing? So, but, uh, all right. So enjoy. So right up here is like one of the huge, huge pokey stops, which you can see. All the people that are up here. We're gonna see if we can get some action. Alright guys, so Merlot in that wine glass. Uh no, no action, no action at all at the park. I'm sad. I talked to some chicks. They didn't want to be in a video though, so I respected their cause and uh you know, so. we're going to the mall now. Alright guys, so I'm a little fucking hungry. Um so I'm gonna come to fucking uh I'm coming to fucking Chick-fil-A, get me a chicken sandwich and some water. You know, still got to eat somewhat healthy. So, um, here's my local Chick-fil-A right over here. Place is usually busy around here. Right after this, we're going to go to the mall. Welcome to Chick-fil-A. This is Emma. How may I serve you? Hi, Emma. Uh, can I have a spicy chicken uh, deluxe, just the sandwich itself? Okay. And a uh, ice water, please. That's everything. Absolutely. It'll be 415 at the window. All right. Thank you. My pleasure. Emma sound hot as fuck though. We're gonna see what Emma do. <laughs> Alright, we're pulling up to the window right now. Hi, Hi. Thank you. My pleasure. Any condiments for the family? Uh no. I'm sorry? No, thank you. Oh. There you go. Thank you. Thanks. Okay, at least she laughed like when I pulled off. She didn't say anything. Damn it. No action. We better get some action at the fucking mall. Plus at the, the restaurant that we're going to later on. So that needs to fucking happen. I'm gonna be pissed. Alright guys, about to eat this sandwich. So if you guys don't have a Chick-fil-A, they're worldwide. You should try them out. They're definitely a healthier option to eat. The chicken's all natural. Look at that sandwich though. It's, just, it's got pepper jack cheese on it. Um, the cool thing is they're like a Christian based place. Like they're closed on Sundays and everything. So um, check them out, it's good food. All right guys, so operation find the gayest shirt possible to make Alex fucking uh, all weirded out of shit all day everywhere that we go is in progress. Um, here at my local uh, mall, so we're gonna go into Spencer's and uh, we're gonna see what we can find. Alright guys, so if you've never been into a Spencer's, this is what a Spencer looks like. There's like a lot of novelties and other things um, that you can check out here. A lot of cool things with like bands over the age of 50 and... Um, just just a lot of sexual things, cool t-shirts, these corsets. Can someone from my stream please wear, we need to get Alex in a corset. Or maybe 
Is that what? How's that how you say him? Hey, what's going on? Is that how you say him? I don't know. That's if that's how you say him. Look at these seduction toys, though. I think I'm kind of feeling like we should do some of those seduction toys right here. Maybe get Alex a dildo. Maybe I put a dildo like on a keychain and carry it around with me all night long tonight. I think that would be. Look at that silky seduction kit. I'm buying that. I'm gonna have to buy that. But yeah, you definitely need to check out a Spencer's. Oh wait, dick glasses. Let's. Go. Hold on. Let's see what these dick glasses look like. You guys tell me. Phenomenal. If I don't get laid wearing that, I don't know what else would get me laid. So, But yeah, definitely check out a, uh, a Spencer's. Like I said, a lot of cool things have to do with either, you know, here's some lamps over here. You got, you got great things from bands. You got cups, you know, from movies, cartoons, anything you can think of. Bands. The shirt that I got, I'm not going to show you guys. However, um, you will see it here soon after I get home and take a shower and you know go along through the vlog. So some beer pong bongs, let's go. Um, but here's some coffee mugs and stuff. Definitely go and check out a Spencer's if you've never been there. A lot of really cool things. Piercings, t-shirts. This is the shirts that I wanted. Look at that. Dorothy in the streets, Blanche in the sheets. Fucking Golden Girls forever, bro. And then the Edward Scissorhands shirt. But they didn't have them in my size, so have a good one, guys. All right, so what's up, guys? Just got out of the shower, got cleaned up. Looking so fresh and so clean, clean. You know, I was thinking, I was thinking maybe I was going for the Brad Pitt instead of the Hitler look today. Like, killing Nazis. But uh, here's my shirt. I couldn't find anything extremely gay to wear, so I got something that... Got straight to the point, straight out of the closet. All right, so we're gonna go see Alex for margaritas, and then we're gonna go out to eat and stuff like that. So enjoy. All right, guys. So we're waiting on Alex to come out of work right now. He'll be outside here in just a second. We're gonna get his initial reaction, and then I guess we're going to a bar across the street to get a margarita or something. So we'll see what's good. All right, here comes Alex right here. What up, bro? <laughs> What? Jesus Christ, hey, what? Going into the... What about my shirt, bro? Oh, we're going to dinner together, bitch. How you feel about that? What do you have? That's what Tiffany got. That's what pillows? <laughs> Yo, if you guys don't know, Tiffany, she was on the man show last week. And they, Jesus I gave them my Christ. bed and they fucking... What do you think about this? We're supposed to go across the street to work people I work with. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, who's this for? Alex. This is gonna be amazing. God. All right, Alex, so what's the possibility of what's happening here? Well, we're going to get margaritas for a friend I work with who's moving to South Carolina. Tomorrow's his last day of work. And you have all seen what Derek looks like right now. <laughs> and he's gay. <laughs> and the guy, the, the guy is gay. Yeah. And there's gonna be, you said, older people in yeah, there? Yeah, it's a bunch of older ladies I work with for the most part. <laughs> so this might be super fucking awkward. What if this is like the Narnia closet? That's what this shirt means, not like gay closet. I'm sure they'll buy it. The rainbows <laughs> don't give anything away or anything. <laughs> Jesus Christ. What do, you, what do you think about the stash? What's, I hate it. No, like, you don't. Zero out of ten, hate it. Are you Derek, serious? I hate bang. it. No, I would not bang. It. <laughs> what? Would not bang. Do you know what I'm saying? Would not bang. Billy talking. <laughs> All right, so I don't know if any of you guys are interested, but here I got the 2012 Barrel Age Christmas Ale, and here's some of the beers that they offer. So, Courtney and Angie just Alex, what did you get to eat? I got the uh, <laughs> the, the super small, small portions. <laughs> yes. uh, All right, so I got a roast beef au jus sandwich. I fucked up so I fucked up so bad. Whatever the fuck this is. It's a uh, fried chicken steam bun. <laughs> All right, guys. So I'm here with Tony. Tony, how long have you worked here at Hoppin' Frogs? Worked here since April, so just a few months. A few months. Okay. One thing I have to ask you is, what? Do you, how do you feel about my stash? It 
was worth the two hundred dollars. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. For sure. Would, would you do a twenty-five cent mush ride, mush stash ride? Be a little bit more than twenty-five cents. <laughs> but yeah. Can you tell me uh, this? Team, this place seems really cool. The beers are really good here. Thank you. Uh, can you tell me a little bit about the history of it? Um, started by Fred Carm, basically an Akron brewing legend in my my opinion. Um, do you know what he's doing? Just kind of started brewing beers, evolved into this place, opened the tasting room uh, three years ago as of like June something, so been, been doing real good for three years. That's, that's for awesome. Sure. That's awesome. Yeah, I'm, I'm highly satisfied and I'll definitely be a returning customer. Nice. And I'm going to be returning because of you. That's what's up. That's the only reason. <laughs> Fuck everybody else. So. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, so the things that we got now are beer shakes. Uh, we got half of each right here. So one is lemon, like, uh, what was it? Lemon, lemon pound, pound cake. cake. And then the other one is chocolate reserve. Are you excited for a beer shake? I've never had a beer shake I haven't before, either. So. Go ahead, taste it. This is the lemon one. All right. <laughs> is it it's good? Really good. Alright, taste the chocolate one. Oh, taste the chocolate one. <laughs> is it strong? Like a, it's like a dark chocolate. Okay. I didn't expect that. Alright. I actually like the lemon one better. I'm about, I'm excited. Alright guys, so we're at Hoppin' Frogs. Of course, you guys have been seeing the vlog all day. What's your name, sir? My name is Mark Lee Shannon. Mark Lee Shannon, and you're the musician tonight. Right? I am your designated sober musician tonight. That's awesome, that's awesome. What are you going to be playing for us tonight? I'll be playing a group of songs ranging from blues to Americana. Uh, some cover songs, some original songs, but mostly songs that uh, I feel are songs that I wish I would have wrote. You know, awesome, awesome. Uh, by sure. great songwriters. Sure. And some people you probably haven't heard of. Okay, okay. Um, I'm going to put you down. If anybody wants to check out Mark, I'll put his Facebook and his Twitter down in the description. Guys, make sure you guys go and follow him, and you'll see some live video of him action right after this. Have a good one. Oh, 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 oh,